¿Han visto el cocodrilo? ¿No lo han visto? ¿Tú no crees que hay un cocodrilo? Ven acá, ven acá, dile que venga para acá. ¿Tú no crees que hay un cocodrilo acá? Oye, dile algo, oye, ella, ella no piensa. Oye, me mojé los pies ya, pero esa mujer no sabe que hay un cocodrilo metido aquí. It's, it's, it's the other guy, bro. <laughs> Get this guy a Snickers bar. Dude, you, Get that, that is the best thing. Ven acá, ven acá, ven acá. Come here, ven acá un momentico, ven acá. Para, para un momentico. Ok. Vamos a hablar en claro un momentico. You, all right. Ok, ¿ustedes hablan en inglés o no? Ok, you guys speak English, right? All right, guys. All right. What's your names? What? Alina? And what else? Jesus and Alina. Okay. How old are you guys? 22. 22? 18. So, Jesus didn't tell Alina that there's a croc bigger than your... Okay. He didn't tell you that? Okay. Okay, look. Okay, look. Are you, are you scared or not? No. You're okay. All right, look. Do this then. Go to the fillet table over there. You see that little fillet table over there? Go to the side, okay, right there, and there's a sign, okay? There's a sign that says what? Go over there real quick. I'm going to film you going over there, and then you tell me if there's a croc in here. Go, go, go. I'm going to... Okay, okay. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to talk to you guys in Spanish, and I'm going to translate. Okay. Vete para allá. A donde está la gente, ahí mismito parado. Y mira a ver el letrero que está ahí, mira, Jesús, esta va a ser la última vez que tú vas a salir con esta muchacha, te lo estoy diciendo ahora mismo, cuando ella vea, cuando ella vea la foto y el video del cocodrilo este se va a morir, ok, mira, él, él se llama, el cocodrilo se llama Fred, ok, Fred, es, es un poquitico más largo de, de yo diría como tres pies más largo del kayak de ese. Bro, ok. Dale, vete para allá, mira el letrero. Go over there real quick. Dale. ¿Dónde está esa gente? Dile que te lean el letrero. ¿Dónde está esa gente ahí mismito? Mira aquí. ¿Tú ves dónde está el señor ese ahí? En, en el... Vete ahí un momentico. Cuidado, cuidado con los botes. All right. I'm telling him to go read the sign. And I told... Oh, oh. Wait a second. Now. Flats? A flat spot making a scene? Ok, cuando pase ese bote, vete y lee el letrero. Y ya con eso, usted... Caballero, una preguntita. ¿Ustedes saben algo de esta, esta marina? Pero, ¿han visto un cocodrilo acá? No, no, no ¿en serio? No, nunca lo he visto. Pero, pero ¿hay uno o no? No lo han visto. Ok, ok. Dice que hay, pero nunca lo he visto. Ok, pasa un momentico. Pa espérate, oh, espérate, Jesús, hay una foto. Now, now he's confessing to the picture. Um, Alina, creo que cuando tú veas este cocodrilo, ¿tú crees que yo estoy bromeando con ustedes? She's telling him to go over there. Okay, mira, vete ahí y dile que te lea el letrero. No, él, él ahora mismito, no creo que está en el agua. Porque hay mucho frío. Oh, 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 oh. Cuidado, cuidado, what are you doing? Back. Oye, ok. Él no está, él no está, él no está en el agua ahora, porque me imagino que hay mucho frío. Pero te garantizo que hay una posibilidad que tenga hambre y va a ir allá. <laughs> all right, all right. ¿Tú sabes dónde él va? Ok, déjame decirte. Él va a donde está esa gente porque pican el pescado, ¿verdad? Pican el pescado y lo tiran al agua. Hey, cuidado. Hey, is there a crocodile on this marina? Oh, 
Really? All right. All right, guys. Bueno, eh, mira, vamos a hacer esto. Yo me llamo Alfred Montanel. Ok. Chequea mi canal de YouTube. Y ustedes van a ver el video de cocodrilo. Varias veces. Oye, ellos no piensan que hay un cocodrilo metido aquí. They don't think there's a crocodile at Black Point. All right, hey. No, no, es que no quieren. Quieren que se lo coma. Hey, let me ask you something. Do you know anything about a crocodile that's in this in this waters? A couple of them. Can you tell those people in English that there's a couple of them in here? Why? They don't know? No, what, what do you... They're not going to fuck with us. There's packers all the time. Bro, you have not seen the videos then. Oh, dude. Nah, I don't even want to worry, you know. They're here, though. I know they're here. I've seen them. Oh, you've seen them? Yeah, I kayak here all the time. All right, well, I'm going to show you a video a little later. It was a guy in a little orange pelican. With a blue paddle! For the rest, for the end of the day. <laughs> How long you been here? Nah, I've been here since the morning. The morning? Yeah, bro. What do you think? You think the you think the chit show just happens by itself? Nah, it doesn't. You think everything, everything, every clip is a good clip? Every clip is not a good clip. So. Are you from here, Dade County? Yeah, born and raised. It's I mean, I moved around a little. Same thing. Yeah. So you told him that the chicho was here, or you told him well, that he the... was the one that told me. You didn't know that the chicho was going on? Wow. He lives five colorway. minutes away, bro. Wow, five bro. Minutes away. He's slipping, bro. And then he brought me over. You, you know, this is Black Marina? He you, said Black Marina. I said, Black Marina? Yeah. Down the street? I was like, nah, take me, take me. Let's go. Let's <laughs> you, go. You don't know how many laughs you've missed, dude. Yeah, you got to watch the show. Even for the kids. I got the kids right here. Really? Really? So they love watching it with me. Jeez, we just stand there, just going right. Look, look, look there you know. <laughs> yeah, they all know. Let's take a quick picture, man. Yeah, let's go. Let's, let's do it. Let, 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 let's, let's go. Let's go. go. Come on. Come on. Take a picture with us. With Alfred. The shit show. We could go with him. Get in here, guys. Oh, my goodness. Come here. Everybody step back. Step back. Go all the way back. All the way over there so I can get everybody on the frame. That is so... What was, what was I just talking about right now? We're in the Alfred Montaner. No, this is not a meet and greet. They're going to be like, dude, why did... We're at the shit show meet and greet, guys. Everybody over here. <laughs> no. Down, no. No, no. Oh, my God. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Dude, we were just talking right now about cigars. He just came from Georgia. And we were talking right now about cigars. Well, listen, you don't know who you met with cigars. <laughs> don't Check out my page, Cigar Social Club, on Instagram. Cigar Social Club. I'm with the man. We're big fans, guys. We're, we're followers. <laughs> bro, thank you. Check it out, bro. Nice to meet you. This is Don Carlos Personal Reserve. Okay. A Duro Fuente. All right. Top of the top, 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 top of the line. Where did I tell you guys right now where I go smoke my cigars? Where did I just tell you guys right now? Next to Publix in Color Bay. No, no, but but when, that's where I said that I can buy them, okay. right? But where do I go smoke them? I just told you guys. I come out through here. Okay, yeah, yeah, to the end. To the end. I get the skyline of Miami. And I smoke my cigar. Well, there you go. Oh my God. That's plug, 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 plug. I'm not your, here to plug, bro. No, 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 no. I know, I know, and I could tell. I could tell. I could tell. I could tell. But plug it because you know what? Cigar if you guys. Cigar Social Club, Instagram, all oh. together. Cigar Social Club. <laughs> this is the best way I can end my day, dude. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't get any better than that. I've been smoking cigars here all day, bro. Well, listen. Um, I want to thank you guys. I want to thank everybody that look. This became a after hour meet and greet without it. <laughs> you know what? Here's what we're gonna do, guys. One day we're going to do a real meet and greet and we're going to all hang out. We're going to bring the kids. We're going to make a scene out here and all the kids and the families and we'll, and we'll do it. And we'll do it right. Look, this just happened spontaneously. So wait for it. It's going to happen, guys. Alfred Montaner making a scene. Look at him. Look at this. Look at this. Hey, I'm going to, I'm going to put this, I'm going to put this on my stories on my Instagram. Oh shit. I just dropped it in the water. I'm going to have to get this shot over here. Oh no, he, he's, I can't get that shot. He's not even going to go into the thing. 
Oh, what is this? Oh boy, hurry up, bro. Get, get it, get it, bro. Get it, get it. No, little kid, don't do nothing. Don't do nothing, kid. You're gonna lose a finger. Your deal don't know how to do jack. Oh no! I'm just kidding, bro. Relax. It was a joke. Damn, they're right in the sun, man. Oh wait, the pescatarian! Hold on, wait, 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 wait. Come here, I want to introduce you to the channel. Come here, 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 come back, come back, come back. Guys, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. I never catch you here. I never ever catch you. This is the swordfish, swordfish monster. So, bro, I've been sharing some of your stuff on my Instagram. Hey, what time are you leaving? When am I leaving? Yeah, here. When that sun goes down. Right, I'm gonna leave the gate open. Why? Can you show me something? Bro, they're buried under 400 pounds of ice. Bro, it's worth it, bro. We got two of them. All right, listen, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go to your yard, and I'm gonna go ahead and show what you caught today. All right, don't, I'm, I'm telling you, once I finish here, I'm gonna go straight to your crib. Okay. All, right. all right, all right, bro, I'll see you in a little bit. All right, guys, so listen up. So, he is a charter captain that focuses on catching swordfish down here in South Florida. Check this out, cool story. Cool story, guys. A lot of you guys have the same story. Got fed up with corporate America. Said, you know what? I love to fish. I'm really good at it. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and start sharing my experiences with a lot of the people that want to do the same thing I do. So most of you guys know that there's a lot of uh, swordfish guys down in the Keys, like Nick Stanzik, which is a popular YouTuber. But this guy, he started to make a name for himself down here in Miami and I want you guys to keep an eye on him check out his Instagram he's called pescatarian on uh, on Instagram and I'm I want to I want to go fishing with him today he uh, one day we've been doing some stuff um, he lives close to me so so that's why I can go to his house so yeah and you guys know that I like kind of like highlighting uh, charter captains and small businesses and stuff like that but but I really love this story that he just said hey listen you know what I'm tired of this I'm gonna do what I love and I'm not gonna work another day in my life and you know but I'll tell you what he's putting in the hours you see him coming in to, to this I mean I, I guess I wake up early in the morning and when I go get my coffee sometimes I see him coming out and he's leaving five six in the morning easy um, to put in the the work so he already knows where they're at. He's perfecting it. Though don't think that that's a little easy task to learn how to catch all those fish. There's a science to that. So I can't wait to film that now when I get back over there. It, it will be dark um, when I film it, but it's gonna be worth it, guys. No, we're good, guys. That's how we park over here after five. After five, it's, it's sideways. Listen, it's gonna get worse, guys. The sun went down and, and the chicho is going down. Look, this is the last thing that they remember of the day boating. And this is where... Well, we're almost there, guys. We're almost there. Po poquita poco. Wait for it. Bro, we got a, we got a couple of late heroes over here.
little sea hunt coming in with the night lights on. shift dude it's straight up nighttime guys my camera is uh, is basically seeing in the dark what is going on here what what's captain Lance doing does he have to tow somebody out of here that's a freedom boat. Well, maybe he does. Hey, those people at Freedom, bro, they have no idea what happens here after hours. Wait, those people have to buy Pad Express by the case, bro. Oh, the night version over here, guys. Oh, my goodness. Okay, here's the thing, guys. It's getting dark early, right? Yeah, the other guy hit it too. Yeah. <laughs> look, look, if you if, if 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 you guys see my my camera is so good it sees in the dark. They think they can run. Yeah. But no one can run from the zoom. Yep. Ahí, bro, estábamos esperando por ti todo el tiempo. Ya nos vamos ahora cuando cuando ahí acabes aquí con el doc. Oh my goodness. You guys think I'm playing. This thing is like This guy this guy sees in the dark, bro. I mean, imagine these guys can't dock during the day with the sunlight. Imagine at night. What was that? That was pretty cool. Well, listen up, guys. Um, I think we're going to end it with that, right? Um, I guess this was the little short version of the night version over here. And uh, let's see if we can get the, the final shot that we always like to get. And, uh, and there it is, guys. There it is. Alfred Montana making a scene. As always, guys, we are out of here. I got to get out of this water because Fred is full advantage right now. He has full advantage.